Inferno is is both the worst map in the active duty pool and it is the worst map in retakes. There is basically no redeeming quality about Inferno. Unquestionably the worst retakes map. Hey guys, Dimitri here with some excellent, excellent news. And that is that Hot Retakes is back. What's more, it is back for good. I'm talking about Hot Retakes live streamed over on the Score Esports' official Twitch channel. Today, we are going to be playing some retakes, mostly on Inferno, which if you know me, you know that I'm really would rather play retakes just about anywhere else. I really hope you enjoy this cut down. I'm so glad to be back and I'm really looking forward to the idea of seeing you guys live hanging out with me in the future. So please, please tune in. See you then. Hot take dragon lore super overrated. No, it's not. It just isn't. Like Zippel always says, right? If you say the dragon lore is overrated, it's just because you don't have one. What the dragon lore did for CSGO skins, what it did for the game, is just like for the economy, like for gambling, for literally all of it, it cannot be overstated. Far and above the most important skin that has ever been released in the game, for sure. You don't have to like what it looks like. I can't tell you that like, you know, if you don't like the design, I mean, I don't know, like Aerosmith says, there's no accounting for taste, right? TF2 copium here. Let's go, dude. Never lose hope you live forever. Look, man, if everyone comes back and plays TF2 for a day, that would be sick. Like, 100%. Woo! I was literally about to say I didn't even warm up. Hot take. Falcon knives are underrated as f***ing at me. I agree. There, there are, like, very few knives that I, in CSGO that I just, like, genuinely think are like trash or like genuinely not cool or something like that. I think the only one that I just like genuinely really don't like is the gut knife. And I feel like that's a, that's a, I feel like it's a pretty standard thing. The gut knife, uh, gut knife needs skin special to its kind of knife, something fitting for a gut knife. That's a really cool idea actually. Yeah, there's something really weird and like off-putting about seeing like, like a gut knife fade or like a gut knife Doppler. You know what I mean? Like, I, I know what you mean. Like there's, it, there, it needs like a, it needs like a special, special, uh, yeah, like like finish or something. MM is dog. Shit. Like MM is dog. Shit literally everywhere. It doesn't matter who you are. It doesn't matter what region you're in. It's it's trash. Like obviously, right? But I think that did I actually not hit that? That's so funny. I think that it's fair to say that it's way worse in Europe than uh, better in Europe. MM is way better in Europe than North America. There's a lot of players in EU. The cheating problem is not as bad. You should obviously still play face it, especially if you're even like remotely serious about the game, but you can play matchmaking in Europe and it's like not a like categorical waste of time the way it is in North America. And to be fair, the biggest problem for a long time wasn't even that like the cheater or the cheater problem was that bad. The biggest problem for a long time, and it may even still be the biggest problem, I just don't play enough MM to really say, is the players. Like, it's been, a, I think it's fair to say that it's been a long time since I've played in a game with a cheater in like a, a prime in NA. The problem with NA uh, MM is that you just are like a Supreme who queues against Silvers, like literally all the time, right? <laughs> this dude just got thanos <laughs> That was so funny, what the f So by how do we make CS more accessible without it impacting the esports scene? There is one real answer to this question, and it is like the answer. Because I'm not saying that there aren't other answers, but it is the most important one, and it is they ha Valve have to fix matchmaking. We are now in like no excuses territory, and there's like no more bullshit. They have to fix matchmaking. We need to stop like doing this thing where we like send people to face it slash ESEA in their first like, you know, whatever, like three months playing the game or something, right? We have to like, the, the infrastructure to CS is just so complicated and inaccessible. Thank you so much for that. Obviously there's, oh, that's no way he loses that. I took no damage to you. All I took was the, the damage of the flash hitting me. That's so funny. I did just get a new monitor and it's extremely Ooh. possible. This guy just got absolutely fucking destroyed. Tell me you're playing retakes on Inferno without telling me you're playing retakes on fucking Inferno. Bro. 
man, there's a lot of fucking smokes for a retake server. I'm not gonna lie. Like, this is a little bit absurd. I haven't seen the bombs. I haven't even seen the fucking bomb set, guys. Like, I'm all for recreating actual conditions of the match, but like, maybe we should chill a little bit with the number of ops and smokes that T side actually gets on Inferno. I'm, I, I, I usually, my time to RTB is usually a, is usually around the half on Inferno. I can make it about a round and a half into this dog shit map before I start calling for a retake vote. An in-game mechanic that I would like to change. I mean, there's definitely little things. Like, for instance, I do sort of think that the armor rebuy system is annoying. Like, if you take one f***ing pistol shot of damage, right, when you buy body armor, you have to pay the full thousand to get head armor. Like, I think we can all agree that's pretty f***ing annoying. Really wish you could sell weapons in CS. My Zoomer assets are being punished for wanting to buy quickly. Yes. Okay, so I absolutely... Th that's kind of what I meant when I said the little things, right? Like, you know, I wish that the molly spread was a little different. I wish that you could... Th the rebuy armor system was a little different. I wouldn't really call these mechanics in the real sense. What am I doing with my life? Oh my god, why am I not... I am the worst player at this video game. But I would call those quality of life things. I wouldn't call them so much mechanics, is my only thing. What are the chickens' names? I have no idea, but you know what I think? I think you're allowed to just to just freely name them. I do believe that Valve is not going to hold it against you. Missed that, of course. How is this f***ing real, dude? How is this real? No! How is this real? Favorite CS skin? I don't know. I These three skins I really love. My Butterfly Lore I really love. Pandora's I really love. And Goomir I really love. Of the three, I don't know which one I like more. Who's that? No. What's up, guys? How you doing? Fancy meeting you up here, eh? Hey, what's up? Hey Dimitri, how are you? I'm really well, friends. How you doing, buddy? Really well. I just voted for Inferno? Oh, absolutely. I just pressed my hotkey by mistake and voted for Inferno. We are absolutely losing right. guys. No f***ing question. No shot. No kizzy. No cap. For real, for real, on God. How do you do, fellow kids? What? Inferno best map at retaking it is not that great. Inferno is is both the worst map in the active duty pool and it is the worst map in retakes. There is basically no redeeming quality about Inferno. Unquestionably the worst retakes map. Really? Oh, what, 20, what? 26 in one? What? Racing is absolutely better than Mario Kart, and it's not even a conversation. It's not even a conversation. Why are we on this map, man? Can we just play a real map where aim and game sense matter, please? Oh my god, you're boosted on one of the 18 boxes in the fucking bomb site. Like, who would have guessed, right? Like, you're in a fucking corner. Who would have guessed? And oh, look, I died swinging you. Down here, salt is a way of life. Obviously, the environment down here is all salt. The, the ceiling's salt, the floor's salt, the walls are salt. And to an extent, the air is soft. Maybe you should sound angry. Maybe you should touch grass. Hoodie on the score esports shop.com. Be sure to check out the score esports merch shop for our newest offerings, including a touch grass hoodie. Yo. Let's maybe chill with that. Let's maybe fucking chill though. Let's maybe chill with this. What the fuck is happening? The game is saying enough barrage for today. Infinite butterfly knife. Yo, butterfly knives for days, boys. We gotta do a full. Hold on, we gotta do a full inspect up here. Holy <laughs> shit. What is happening? I've never paid, despite the fact that I have like literally fucking an ungodly amount of money for takes, I've never actually paid for the VIP. Uh, for the VIP thing, I would pay a hundred percent. I would pay a monthly fee to be able to join a retake server that does not have Mirage and Inferno. A hundred percent, I would do it. If I could just play cash retakes all day, every day, I would absolutely and like throw a little vertigo in there, throw a little train in there. Around. They talk about my one taps. Nice. 
Ancient retakes, I think, is good. I just don't think that they've figured out the spawns yet, which is completely understandable. Cash? Yes, cash is the single best retakes map. But it has nothing to do with the fact that whether it's in the active duty pool or doesn't. This is the problem that people have that people don't seem to understand. Retakes has nothing to do with being in the active duty pool. The whole point of retakes is to warm up for a match. The whole point of retakes is not to get opt 17 times by some Nova behind new box. And then the second that you switch to T side, he just leaves the game because he got his 17. And, and he leaves thinking he's he's warmed up now. God, man, I hate this map. Oh, the guy AFK in underpass switching his skins. Fucking classic. It, are you even playing retakes if there isn't a guy AFK in underpass switching his fucking skins? I was gonna molly, but I just genuinely didn't think he could be there. I thought the spawn was so fast that it. Oh, maybe. Good time to call it, chat. Good time to call it. Thanks for watching. If you want more content like this, hit the sub button and ring the notification bell. For unique bite-sized videos you won't find anywhere else, hit us up on our Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok.